The Kranagmen are reclusive people who dwell in the swamps of the Neck. They are ruled by House Reed from Greywater Watch, and their current lord is Holland Reed. The Kranagmen are so called for their habit of living in small villages formed of reeds and thatch that sit atop floating islands in the mire. They are poor people and seldom leave their lands, subsisting on fishing and frogging. They are talented hunters and warriors, and despite their short stature and somewhat primitive lifestyle, the Kranach men have proven a notoriously difficult people to conquer. They use nets, bronze knives, frog spears and round leather shields. They fight with poison, guerrilla tactics and a mastery of their difficult terrain. According to those who have fought them, their houses and even their castles move. They are disparaged as frog eaters, swamp dwellers, madmen and bog devils by most other people of the Seven Kingdoms, and are looked down upon for their tactics, which are viewed as cowardly. Some claim that the Kranigsman's smaller size is because of intermarriage with the children of the forest while others attribute their size to poor nutrition. The histories say that the Kranogman grew close to the children of the forest in the days when the Green Seers tried to bring the Hammer of the Waters down upon the neck. The Kranogman and their marsh kings held Maud Kellen against Southron invaders. They swore oath of fealty to the Starks thousands of years ago when King Richard Stark slew the last Marsh King and took his daughter as his wife. Other families of Cranach Man, besides House Reed, are House Fen, Peat, Boggs, Cray, Quag, Greengood and Blackmire. They have a feud with House Frey, who have ruled the lands immediately to the south in the northern riverlands for six centuries. Rob Stark says to Catelyn Tully, I've sent the word to Holland Reed, father's old friend at Greywater Watch. If the Lannisters come up the neck, the Kranigman will bleed them every step of the way. Little Walder Frey to Theon Greyjoy. Madmen are sneaks. They won't fight like decent folks. They skulk and use poison arrows. You never see them, but they see you. Those who go into the box after them get lost and never come out. Their houses move, even the castles like Greywater Watch. Georgian Reed to Bran Stark We live closer to the green in our box and crannocks, and we remember earth and water, soil and stone, oaks and elms and willows, they were here before us all and will still remain when we are gone.